As far as building off of Saturday's performance and getting a week off and going into this one fresh, does it kind of feel good? It, yeah, I feel like we got a lot, you know, more time to prepare for this game. You know, we, we, we don't have that one at their place, but we got to you know, defend our court and try to, you know, get a win on Saturday. So. Is it refreshing for this group to know that there's still a lot to play for, uh, even with the struggles? Yeah, see, I, most of, a couple of guys, well, most of them have never been to the tournament, so, you know, they, everyone's still fighting for that goal. We're trying to get there and make sure, you know, we don't enter our last year or some of them their first year, like, off to a bad start. You know, we want to get, like, a different experience than what they're used to. So. Just the week off for you personally, what did it do for the health of your ankle and where you? how are you feeling now? Some of the couple of games I sat out or some of this, this. Just having the bye here. week this week and not a game. Since. You know, just gives me time to do, do more rehab and do stuff in the weight room with Dom, you know, strengthen my leg again. But, you know, I feel like getting my bounce back. Like, I was feeling real good in TCU. And, you know, I, it was just, I was, it was so like a game time decision if I was playing or not. But then I got the warm ups and I was feeling real good. So. I feel like I, uh, this week has given me a little bit more time just to recover. I'm feeling real nice, feeling good today. Coach Kruger was kind of saying you're getting back, you know, more hop and more balance. Do you feel like you're kind of getting close to 100% in terms of like where your athleticism was? Yeah, I feel like I'm getting pretty close to that. Like I said before, at TCU, I could do all my, I couldn't do my trick dunks for a while, you know, it was, it was hurting me. Or I couldn't, you know, I like, couldn't run as fast as I wanted to. I couldn't jump as high, but I feel like it's all coming back. So I feel like my, and that's part of that's a big part. That's actually all a part of my game. You know, I'm just trying to out athleticism so I can be a better athlete. So. You mentioned the tournament. How tough was it two years ago when you guys didn't play in the tournament? Hey, it hurt. Uh, that's, that's that's all I can say about that. You know, that's that was a tough time, but you know, we, we bounced back. We're just trying to bounce back again. As a senior, can you look back at those games and realize you don't want to put yourself in that position again uh, your I, final year? Uh, for sure, just as you said, like no one's trying to put yourself in that decision. Like I said earlier, we're just trying to, you know, make it make it to the tournament, get some guys some new experiences. So, do you listen to that kind of stuff, or like, are you refreshing ESPN, trying to see if you're still in the bracket? No, I, I, I actually never look at that. I just look at the stuff people post. You know, be sending to me on Twitter or something like that. They be tagging me in. That's about all I see because they it's in, in my mentions, but. Fun. What was it like facing Jackson Hayes the first time? And um, just you guys seem to be similar players with your athleticism. Hey man, that's a that's a tough kid, man. I, I like him, man. I like his game. Just real athletic, real long. You know, it's hard to get shots up over him. And, you know, he got he got good footwork for a young kid. So, play he'd be a great player, like especially in the future. Especially if he gets a little stronger, you know, he'd be dominating. So. Being a Texas kid, and this is your last guaranteed game against Texas. What does that mean to you, this rivalry? You know, we got to go ahead and get in it with a dub. You know what I'm saying? Get a W. That's, that's all. That's what this is about. About getting the win. Will you be throwing the horns down if you win? I'm, I'm, I'm not trying to be disrespectful. I don't. <laughs> yeah, I, I, you know, I, I got a couple of friends on the team, so I ain't really, ain't really up to all that. I'm going to keep it, keep it peaceful.